Anglo-Saxon runes are runes used by the early Anglo-Saxons as an alphabet in their writing. The characters are known collectively as the Futhork or Fjork, from the Old English sound values of the first six runes. The Futhork was a development from the 24-character Elder Futhark. Since the Futhork runes are thought to have first been used in Frisia before the Anglo-Saxon settlement of Britain, they have also been called Anglo-Frisian runes. They were likely used from the 5th century onward, recording Old English and Old Frisian. After the 9th century, they were gradually supplanted in Anglo-Saxon England by the Old English Latin alphabets introduced by Irish missionaries. Runes were no longer in common use by the year 1000. History there are competing theories about the origins of the Anglo-Saxon Futhork. One theory proposes that it was developed in Frisia and from there spread later to England. Another holds that runes were first introduced to England from Scandinavia where the Futhork was modified and then exported to Frisia. Both theories have their inherent weaknesses, and a definitive answer may come from further archaeological evidence. The early Futhork was identical to the elder Futhark, except for the split of a into three variants, ak, esk and os, resulting in 26 runes. This was necessary to account for the new phoneme produced by the Ingvianic split of allophones of long and short a. The earliest, os rune is found on the 5th century Unli Bractite. Ak was introduced later, in the 6th century. The double-barred, Hegel characteristic of continental inscriptions is first attested as late as 698, on St. Cuthbert's coffin, before that, the single-barred Scandinavian variant was used. In England, the Futhork was further extended to 28 and finally to 33 runes, and runic writing in England became closely associated with the Latin scriptoria from the time of Anglo-Saxon Christianization in the 7th century. The Futhork started to be replaced by the Latin alphabet from around the 7th century, but it was still sometimes used up until the 10th or 11th century. In some cases, texts would be written in the Latin alphabet, but runes would be used logographically in place of the word it represented, and Orn and In came to be used as extensions of the Latin alphabet. By the Norman conquest of 1066, it was very rare and disappeared altogether shortly thereafter. From at least five centuries of use, fewer than 200 artifacts bearing Futhork inscriptions have survived. Several famous English examples mix runes and Roman script, or Old English and Latin, on the same object, including the Frank's casket and St. Cuthbert's coffin. In the latter, three of the names of the four evangelists are given in Latin written in runes, but Lucas Saint Luke is in Roman script. The coffin is also an example of an object created at the heart of the Anglo-Saxon church that uses runes. A leading expert, Raymond Ian Page, rejects the assumption often made in non-scholarly literature that runes were especially associated in post-conversion Anglo-Saxon England with Anglo-Saxon paganism or magic. <laughs> Letters the Anglo-Saxon rune poem Cotton Otho B by .165 has the following runes, listed with their Unicode glyphs, their names, their transliterations, and their approximate phonetic values in IPA notation. The first 24 of these directly continue the Elder Futhark letters, extended by five additional runes, representing additional vowels a, a, y, ia, ea, comparable to the five fourfta of the Oum alphabet. Orn and in were introduced into the English version of the Latin alphabet to represent theta and with, but they were replaced with th and w in the Middle English period. The letter sequence, and indeed the letter inventory, is not fixed. Compared to the letters of the rune poem given above, f u o r c w h n i j e o p x s t b e m l o d a a y i o e the tem scramisax has 28 letters, with a slightly different order, and eel missing. F U O R C W H N I I O E O P X S T B E D L M J A A Y E. The Vienna Codex also has 28 letters. The Ruthwell Cross inscription has 31 letters. Cotton Domitian Aix, 11th century, has 33 letters, with the four following additional runes. 30. C or K W, a modification of P or. 31. Calc. Chalice. K, when doubled appearing as KK. 32. Stan. Stone. Street. 33. Gar. Spear. 
G as opposed to palatalized of these four additional letters, only the C or rune fails to appear epigraphically. The stand shape is found on the Westeremden U stick, but likely as a Spiegelrin. The calc rune is found on the Bramham Moor Ring, Kingmore Ring, the Ruthwell Cross, and Bucastle Cross inscriptions. The Gar rune is found on the Bucastle Cross inscription, along with the doubled calc rune in select locations. Cotton Domitian AX reaches thus a total of 33 letters, according to the transliteration introduced above arranged in the order FUORC W H N I J E O P X S T B E M L D O A A Y A I O C K Street in the manuscript. The runes are arranged in three rows, glossed with Latin equivalents below in the third row above, and with their names above in the third row below. The manuscript has traces of corrections by a 16th-century hand, inverting the position of M and D. E O L H is mistakenly labeled as Siegel, and in place of Siegel, there is a con-like letter corrected to proper Siegel above it. EOH is mislabeled as EEL. Apart from Ing and Ear, all rune names are due to the later scribe, identified as Robert Talbot died 1558. Another Futhork row is found in Cotton Galba AE. The 9th century Codex Sangalensis 878 attributed to Wallifred Strabo records an abecedarium anguliscum in three lines. The first two lines list the standard 29 runes, i.e. the 24 derived from Elder Futhark, and the five standard additional ones A, A, Y, I, O, A, A. The listing order of the final two of the Elder 24 runes is Dag, Ale. A peculiarity is the asterisk shape of EOLH. The third line lists Gar and Kalk, before a doodling repetition of other runes. Inscription corpus Topic. The Old English and Old Frisian Runic Inscriptions Database Project at the Catholic Universität Eichstätt Ingolstadt, Germany aims at collecting the genuine corpus of Old English inscriptions containing more than two runes in its paper edition, while the electronic edition aims at including both genuine and doubtful inscriptions down to single rune inscriptions. The corpus of the paper edition encompasses about 100 objects including stone slabs, stone crosses, bones, rings, brooches, weapons, urns, a writing tablet, tweezers, a sun dial, comb, bracteets, caskets, a font, dishes, and graffiti. The database includes, in addition, 16 inscriptions containing a single rune, several runic coins, and eight cases of dubious runic characters rune-like signs, possible Latin characters, weathered characters. Comprising fewer than 200 inscriptions, the corpus is slightly larger than that of Continental Elder Futhark about 80 inscriptions, c. 400 to 700, but slightly smaller than that of the Scandinavian Elder Futhark about 260 inscriptions, c. 200 to 800. Runic finds in England cluster along the east coast with a few finds scattered further inland in southern England. Frisian finds cluster in West Frisia. Louis Henga lists 23 English including two 7th century Christian inscriptions and 21 Frisian inscriptions predating the 9th century. Topic: <inaudible> Inscriptions. Topic: Currently known inscriptions in Anglo-Frisian runes include Topic: <inaudible> Frisian Topic Forward Comcase, 6th century, Miure Ame Comb, c. 600, Ida Ustin Comb, 8th century, Aib Ka M Bu, Dita Habuku with a triple barred H Tornward Comb, 8th century, Kabu Scanamodi Solidus, 575-610, Scanamodu Harlingen Solidus, 575-625, Hada, 2 AC runes, double barred H. Schweindorf Solidus, 575-625, Wella, N. Du. Wayland, or Aladu, running right to left. Folkestone Tremissus, c. 650, Inawulufu. Midlam Seat, c. 750, Appa. Raskert sword handle, whalebone handle of a symbolic sword, late 8th century, ek u medit oka, i, oka, not made mad. Compare ek unwads from the Danish corpus. Aram sword, a u wood miniature sword, late 8th century, edeboda. 
Westeremden A, A U weaving slay, a du gislum, gisahidu. Westeremden B, A U stick, 8th century, O P H, N muji, Ademla, Wimoy, Ahu? I W I O, U, Du, Ale. Britsum U stick, Nyabaradid, N, B S R S D N U, the K has younger futhark shape and probably represents a vowel. Hantum whalebone plate, aha, K, the reverse side is inscribed with Roman Abba. Bernsterburn whalebone staff, c. 800, Tuta Awudu Kios U Tuta. Hamwich horse knucklebone, dated to between 650 and 1025, Kati categorized as Frisian on linguistic grounds, from asterisk Kauten, knucklebone. Wynaldum B gold pendant, c. 600, Hiwi. Canton's comcase, early 5th century, Li. Who bained him comb, c. 700, NLU, dead. Wynaldum A antler piece, Zwuwas. English Topic Ash Gilton, Kent, Gilt Silver Sword Pommel, 6th century, Emsajimer. Chessel Down I, Isle of Wight, 6th century, BW Seacaw. Chessel Down II, Isle of Wight, Silver Plate, attached to the scabbard mouthpiece of a ring sword, early 6th century, Ico, Ori. Borley, Kent, Copper Disc Brooch, C. 600, Ersel. Harford Norfolk brooch, c. 650, Luda, Gibbotesagili. Luda repaired the brooch. West Hesslerton, North Yorkshire, copper cruciform brooch, early 6th century, Nime. Loveden Hill, Lincolnshire, Urn, 5th to 6th century, reading uncertain, maybe Saibid Iuhlaw. The grave of Saibid the maid. Spong Hill, Norfolk, three cremation urns, 5th century, decorated with identical runic stamps, reading alu in Spiegelrunen. Kent two coins, some 30 items, 7th century, reading pata. Kent three, IV silver siatas, c. 600, reading appa and epa. Suffolk gold shillings, three items, c. 660, stamped with deseona. Caster by Norwich Astragalus, 5th century, possibly a Scandinavian import, in Elder Futhark transliteration reading Ryan. Ro. Watchfield Oxfordshire copper fittings, 6th century, Elder Futhark reading Haraboki, WUSA with a probably already fronted to A. Wakerley Northamptonshire copper brooch, 6th century, Bahui. Dover Kent brooch, C. 600, DBLI, BKK Upper Thames Valley Gold Coins, 4 items, 620s, Bennu, Tigoi, Bennu, plus, TD Willoughby on the Wolds, Nottinghamshire, Copper Bull, C. 600, A Cleatham, South Humbershire, Copper Bull, C. 600, Edda Sandwich, Richborough, Kent, Stone, 650 or earlier, Ahabu, I, perhaps asterisk Rahabel, Stag, Whitby I, Yorkshire, Jet Spindle Whorl, UAU Selzy, West Sussex, Gold Plates, 6th to 8th centuries, BRNRN, ANMU St. Cuthbert's Coffin, Durham, dated to 698 Whitby II, Yorkshire, Bone Comb, 7th century, Day, Us Maeus Godalawalu do Helipai Sai, i.e. Deus Maeus, God Alawaldo, Helpai Sai, My God, Almighty God, God, help Sai, Sinulf or a similar personal name, compare also names of God in Old English poetry, the Franks casket, 7th century zoomorphic silver gilt knife mount, discovered in the River Thames near Westminster Bridge late 8th century, the Ruthwell Cross, 8th century, the inscription may be partly a modern reconstruction the Brandon Antler piece, WOHS Wildum Diore and this grew on a wild animal, 9th century. Kingmore Ring the Sow of Beignoth, 9th century also known as the Thames Scramasax, the only complete alphabet topic Related manuscript texts topic Codex Vindobonensis 795 9th century The Anglo-Saxon rune poem Cotton Otho B by .165 Solomon and Saturn Noel Codex topic See also topic Elder Futhark Ohm Runic Alphabet topic Notes topic topic References topic Bamsberger, A. ed. 1991, Old English Runes and Their Continental Back Background, Anglistische Forschungen, Heidelberg, 217. 2006, Das Futhark und Sein Weitrentwicklung in der Anglo-Friesischen Überlieferung, in Bamsberger, A. Waxenberger, Das Futhark und Sein Einzelsprechlichen Weitrentwicklungen, Walter de Greider, pp. 171-87, ISBN 3-11-019008-7. 
Hines, J. The Runic Inscriptions of Early Anglo-Saxon England, in Bamsberger, A., Britain 400–600, Language and History, Heidelberg, pp. 437–56. J. H. Luihenga, Runes Around the North Sea and on the Continent AD 150–700, Dissertation, Groningen University 1997. Odenstedt, Bengt, On the Origin and Early History of the Runic Script, Uppsala 1990, ISBN 91-85352-20-9, Chapter 20, The Position of Continental and Anglo-Frisian Runic Forms in the History of the Older Futhark page, Raymond Ian 1999. An Introduction to English Runes. Woodbridge, Boydell Press. ISBN 0-85115-768-8. Robinson, Orin W. 1992. Old English and its Closest Relatives, A Survey of the Earliest Germanic Languages. Stanford University Press. ISBN 0-8047-1454-1. Frisian Runes and Neighboring Traditions, Amsterdamer Beatrice zur Alteren Germanistik 45 1996. H. Marquardt, Die Runeninschriften der Britischen Inseln Bibliographie der Runeninschriften nach Fundorten, B.D. I. Abandlungen der Akademie der Wissenschaften in Göttingen, Phil, Hist. Class, Dritte Folge, N.R., 48, Göttingen 1961, pp. 10-16. Further reading topic Louihenga, Tinnicki, September 2003. Texts and Contexts of the Oldest Runic Inscriptions Northern World, 4. Brill. ISBN 978-9004123960. Topic. External links Topic. Transliteration from Latin alphabet to Anglo-Saxon runes Anglo-Saxon runic texts at Georgetown Univ NYTT Ohm Runer Early runic inscriptions in England